Hi, my name's Adam and today I'm going to be reviewing a book called Who Was That Person? How to Identify Someone from Just Their Eyebrows by Dr. Donna Shawantowski. And the writer Dr. Donna has developed advanced learning techniques and great memory skills over the past 10 years. So you know you're dealing with a proper professional. She holds a degree in herbology, a BS in biology, and a BS in nutrition. So she pretty much knows her stuff. Throughout the book, there's loads of high quality and informative pictures to help your learning and to test your face recognition techniques. Now to start off, the book is a fantastic read. It's very informative and gets right straight to the point on a lot of things. Now. This is a book entirely based about face recognition. It teaches you the fundamental stages of starting how to, how to get into face recognition. And more importantly, why it is so successful and so useful in your life. Probably one of my favorite parts of the book is that there are quotations thrown in every now and then from popular series like Sherlock Holmes written by Arthur Doyle. To really build up your confidence of why face recognition is a really valued skill. It includes a brilliant take the face memory test and this basically tests your face recognition skills and gives you a rank. The book then talks about face morphing and what an important skill it is to have. And once you pass the introduction, the book gets into the details and depths of face recognition. The first two chapters talk about how skills of face recognition can overcome barriers like language and does a brilliant case study with fourth graders and shows how their brains are more perceptive to face recognition than an adult brain. That's amazing. The middle of the book goes on about the characteristics of your face, and importantly, the T-zone. And this is where we get on to the eyebrows. Like these. And most importantly, the eyebrows is where everything starts. You wouldn't think it, but the book really, really goes into great depth about this, and makes very good points, with a key factor being the eyebrow shape, and why it can be so memorable to people when recognising faces. Then, even onto the eyebrow thickness. Again, I'm a prime example on how to memorise eyebrows using emphasis, and even memorising eyebrows by adding the wow factor. The final part of the book goes on to the eyebrow level and how it's easily overlooked, and then even shows you some average and unusual brow characteristics. The part of the book that really got me, which really taught me something, was a chapter called How Do I Know That I'm Learning? And how face recognition isn't something you learn overnight. It's something that you gradually build up and build up when you keep reading people's faces. And, as it exactly says in this chapter, once you finish reading this book, you'll have a new perspective on how you've learned. And then, like me, it's difficult to go back to the old way of looking at faces. All in all, this is a brilliant book and I really advise you to buy it.